some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves at a traffic stop where a soft tart has been pulled over for not displaying the plates on his car and refuses to show his driver's license afterward, claiming that it's a violation of his rights. So, you know, the typical soft tart BS that we've all come to ridicule and laugh at. So, if you want to laugh some more, let's sit back, relax, and laugh at the stupidity of this guy. Howdy, sir. Hey. Hang on, Deputy Orton, Sheriff's Office. Yeah, can, I get your, uh, can I get your name and badge number, please? Let me my seal. I'm Deputy Orton, Sheriff's Office. I do have to let you know you're being audio and video recorded on my body camera. The reason I stopped you is because you don't have any plates on your vehicle. Well, uh, what crime com did I commit? Are you deaf or just plain stupid, soft tart? Because he gave you the reason for the traffic stop. No plates on your vehicle, which is a law that requires it in every state in the union. All right, so you need to have a registration plate for your vehicle to be driving on a state highway. I didn't commit a crime. No, right, you're not so you, you cannot be driving around on, a, on a, one of our roads without a license plate on your vehicle or a temp tag or something displaying the vehicle and the registered owner and the type of vehicle. Okay. Do you understand that? No. Well, I've been studying law for about three years now. Reading those soft tarred pamphlets that you find in the dumpster is not exactly studying the law, dude. I mean, come on now, get with it. I, I understand a lot of okay, that's a lot that you guys don't right. are, I've been, I've been learn. A lot longer than that. Regardless, I do need your driver's license, registration, and proof of insurance for the vehicle. Did you take an oath to the Constitution? Sir, I need your driver's license, your registration, or proof of insurance for the vehicle. You t well, this isn't you, a vehicle. Do you know what 18 U.S.C. 241, 242 is? I'm only going to ask you. Yeah, dude, I hear that so often. I hear it in my sleep nowadays. Deprivation of rights under color of law argument coming out of your mouths, which is all about civil rights. It has nothing to do with traffic laws, you bloody moron. I mean, what's next? The UCC and Admiralty Laws? I mean, that's definitely in the soft tart handbook. A couple more times, and at that point, they don't have to pull you out of the vehicle because you're obstructing justice at this point. The legality of the stop is that you don't have a plate yeah. on your vehicle. Sweetheart, okay? let's phone 911. I'm on traffic let's emphasis call, today. Let's call 911 my, because my we're, being, we're being illegally be detained. Stopping cars. Let's call 911. traffic laws. Dumbass! You dumbass! You're a dumbass! Such a dumbass! You're an ass! Yeah, uh, calling the police about a police officer doing his job on a traffic stop, not exactly the brightest thing you can do. Let's call my Traffic law, you violated today. So you don't have a we haven't violated vehicle. any traffic I haven't traffic. committed a crime. So, right? No, I'm, we haven't violated Why is everybody else getting traffic? this, but you guys aren't? You're the 11th person I've stopped today. I've stopped people. There's a lot of people getting it, but you guys aren't, because we don't have an army behind us. I need your driver's Sir? license, your registration, your proof of insurance. Sir? I don't want to make this worse than it needs to be. Right. I mean, you, you, you take me to jail, I'm going to bail out anyways, and then I'm going to go file a tort lien. Okay, well, I still need oh. driver's license, registration, proof of insurance. There's no, there is no, there's no law saying that we have to have either any of that. Are you that serious? Here's a example out of Wisconsin that says you most certainly have to have it. So, you soft tires, before you make blanket statements about uh, the non-existence of traffic laws, you really need to do your uh, research, do your due diligence, so you don't make yourselves like a, like a couple of incompetent buffoons. You, you are harming me at this point. I'm not harming You're putting you me under stress and duress. I've committed no crime. I've done nothing. I have done not a thing. What time, what time is it? I'm not stepping out of the vehicle. Well, then I'll have to I, have, I have not committed a crime. I've done anything. At that point, then I'll have to force you out of the vehicle. I don't want to do that. I'm just trying to... No, you don't want to do that because I will sue you. I will. I'm a how. Deputy Orr. O-R-R. Right on my name. You took an oath to uphold and defend the Constitution against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Right now, you're acting what 18 U.S.C. 2331 says. This is your last chance, and I'm going to pour you out. You know, it doesn't matter to me. I'm going to... I'm going to... I'm not doing anything wrong. I haven't done anything wrong. You're acting like a tyrant. Because he's 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 actually detained. No, I need to record all of this. How are we going to call 911? 
I'll go, go in and get somebody to call 911. Sure. Because, like, we need to all have this recorded. All your license registration insurance. It can be dealt easier or it can make it difficult. I'm right. trying to go the easy route. But, but law, what law says that I have to have a license? If you're driving on the road, you need to have a license plate on your vehicle. I'm not driving. You're not driving. I'm not driving. I have freedom of travel. Which you are driving good. on the road. You can claim the sovereign stuff all you want, but you have to be, you have to be having a license on your person to be operating a motor vehicle on a state highway. Let's try that. You're on a highway and a city road. Both. He's going to call 911. Okay. I'm just going to bail out. I'm just, I mean, I'm not I'm trying, like, I don't want to have to take any deal. It's a lot of work for nothing when you can just give your license, your registration, your proof of insurance for the vehicle. It's my information. It's my, I, that is protected under the Fourth Amendment. Why? Why is it that y'all forget that? Oh, you you took an oath to defend the right Constitution right against all four enemies, foreign and domestic. A request to see your driver's license during a traffic stop is not a Fourth Amendment violation, and your driver's license is not your property anyway. It is issued to you by the state once you prove you are able to drive that motor vehicle on an open road without any issues. If you are unable to do that, then it can and will be revoked. And I'll tell you another thing. There's there's two the the the, the, the there's two companies. There's two, one of them is called Police One. I can't remember the other. They're both Chinese owned, and they they are involved with with y'all's training. Okay, what is that Chinese? To do today with you not with you driving on a road without a plate? Because why did you, why do you all not get the the oath? I mean, was you just lying when you took the oath to pull the fin well, of the It's all recorded, so if you have questions about it, regardless. Why is it a felony to ignore I didn't say it? It was a felony. You're causing you're causing emergency when there never was one. I never committed a crime. I was just going down the street. I was just driving. I was just, just traveling down the highway. I don't have to answer any questions. Yeah, you don't have to answer the questions, but you still have to provide all the reasonable documents they require the license registration and proof of insurance okay this is your last warning on the ms40 out of the car and you can try to lock the door you want but then i'll have to break the window open and i don't want to do that either I, do, I don't i don't have to i don't have to be dragged out of here well, i haven't done anything to harm you you're harming me you, you never did give me your, you never did give me your badge you number can you give me a badge number? You're, 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 badge you are a public number. servant. You can look at the badge if, you want, there's no and, number on it. And what, what is your name? Right there. Deputy Orr. I told you that in the beginning. I told you and your, your, the lady you wrote my name down. So. My wife. Okay, your wife. I don't want to assume. We just tried to go wash some clothes okay. and have some lunch. You, not, I, uh, not bothering anybody. What's that? We're not bothering anybody. Right, but you are violating a traffic law, hence the reason for the stop. It's a statute. So you justice, so at that point, now it's becoming a criminal matter. When it all before was just, I wanted to make sure you were aware you didn't have a plate, and it would have been a friendly stop, but now we're turning it hostile because you're refusing to cooperate with me. No, y'all escalate to the point where you don't... I'm not escalating, I'm not yelling, I'm not swearing, I'm not doing anything. It's all on camera, you're more than welcome to take it to court all you'd like. But I've been doing this long enough to know that you have to drive a vehicle with the registration plate or a temp tag on if the If it's a commercial vehicle, so when I this is vehicle, not a commercial vehicle. A Here you go, let me reiterate the Wisconsin example of the laws you say don't exist, especially when it comes to non-commercial vehicles. So at that point, when I request the driver's license, your registration, and your insurance, you're supposed to give it to me. Because if you don't, then you're obstructing justice at that point. And I'm trying to... I'm trying to avoid putting you in handcuffs, but all I'm trying to do is get your information for the stop. Right? You're not the first person I've stopped today, you won't be the last person I've stopped today. I'm on traffic enforcement, that's my duty today. Can I get your name? At this point, you just need my license? license you just need my registration? Okay. I got it. It's registration. Bust the pumps, dude. But I'm gonna take the fifth right now. See what? I'm gonna I'm gonna plead the fifth right now. Plead the fifth all you want, dude, but you still have to hand over your registration, your license, and your proof of insurance at a traffic stop. It's as simple as that. The fifth? Okay. Well, I, I mean, uh, actually, I'm invoking the Fifth Amendment. Okay. Well, 
Well, regardless, you still are obligated to give me a license registration. I ain't obligated to give you shit. Okay. You do realize that today is Thursday, and by the time you probably see a judge, it won't be. T you won't be able to bail out by Monday. Yeah, I bet that'd make, make you happy, happy wouldn't it? Figure how difficult you made this. There probably won't be a bail put out. I bet that make you feel really good, wouldn't no, it? No, it doesn't. That's Next. why I haven't pulled you out of the car yet. I'm trying to get your license, registration, and insurance. Have I been rude to you or disrespectful? No. Why can't you just let me I go wash my clothes with my wife? Why I is that so hard? You, I haven't touched you. I haven't. Uh, nothing. I I'd haven't. I'd like to think I'm standing pretty relaxed right now. Right now, and in, in, in reality, you are the criminal right now. I'm the criminal. Uh, no, yeah. If you look at 18 U.S.C. 230, you're trying to impose government policy, a corporate government policy, uh, onto the civilian population. That's what you're doing right now. Look it up. Okay. It's a federal law. Final it one. trumps. Are you not going to cooperate with me? You're going to bully me, and you're going to assault me, right? I'm not bullying you. I'm not assaulting you. I'm going to pull you out of the vehicle. Yeah. Can I talk to my wife first? Yeah, you can talk to her. Look. She's inside, though. Yeah, but if I get out, you're going to... She'll, she'll be out in just a minute. She's talking right. on the phone. When she gets out, when she gets, when she comes out here, when she comes out, I just need to talk to her in private for a minute, and then I'll get out, and you can take me in wherever you want to do. I, I, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not coming voluntarily. It's, it's under force. It's under. It's under threat, threat and duress. No, because I'm standing up for my rights. I'm tired of us being. I have our rights trampled. Is enough of the persecution complex on your part, you lead paint drinking soft tarred moron. This officer has been nothing but nice to you this whole time. He's been trying to enforce the traffic laws. He has not been trampling on your rights at all today you are a complete moron okay. and y'all need to start doing the same thing and start helping us out us, us that are standing up for our rights to help you because out, we're going to have complete and total country. communism in this country if you don't okay. and right now y'all got a complete army behind you that's why we that we have army you talking about i'm here with one other person right now but what if everybody else started getting pissed off about having their rights trampled on all the time and wanted to stand up for them? Okay, no, there'd be a National Guard here. We're, we're all tired of it. We're all tired. Are you going to give me your license, registration, proof of insurance or not? I'm, I'll, I'll need to talk to my wife. Okay. And then I'll, can you go get his wife? He wants to talk to her real quick. What's that? He wants to, can you get his wife? He wants to talk to her real quick. And then, and then you're willing to come out? I don't think he should go to bed in the bus. Well, no, he's just wanting to talk to her. Okay. And then he says he's willing to come out. Okay. So, if you want to step out politely, I'll even let you talk to me and I won't put you in cuffs at that point. Once you finish, then I will. And I'll even let you record. As long as you cooperate with me. Oh, you have, I'm, you. this is First Amendment. I mean, I have every right to record. I don't have to ask I'm permission. Not, I'm not saying you can't. I'm just saying I'll let you hold it while you record and everything you want. But I'm saying I'm not going to grab you and snatch you up when you come out. If you want to cooperate with me, get out of the car, then I'll be cooperating with you. You want to talk to you. She's got every right to get back in here. It's her. It's our property. It's it's our property. We have every right. He wants to talk to you right now. I want to talk to her in private. Are you going to talk to him or not? Because I don't want to have to take you to jail as well. Okay? I don't even want to take him to jail. See, they just, they, they, they just, that's, that, that they're getting out of hand with this shit. And right now you're interfering my entire investigation on a simple... On a, there's no crime. There's no crime committed. There's absolutely no crime. Y'all ain't doing this shit right. <laughs> hey, let me, can not Yes, we do have. We have the authority to be, to not be interfered with. Sophia. In contact with your husband. Have your conversation with your husband. Sophia. Um. Can. Can you. Can you. Uh. When you. When you get back. Can. Can you call a taxi? Well, I'm gonna need my. Like, I'm gonna need you to give me my the bank card. Of, like. So that I'm not stuck yeah. without any, any way to, you know. Well, you'll need, you'll need to uh, also, you'll need to talk, uh, call, call a taxi. Mm -hmm. And then uh, on the refrigerator, there's uh, 
the... Well, we shouldn't have to, to create a bond because then we're going to be creating joinder. And... Well, at least they're becoming smart enough to call a cab. I mean, they're going to need it here shortly. Gonna actually buy, like, accept their Ill illegal activity here? But this asshole right here told me that's willing to violate my constitutional right. No, he no, told, no, no, told no, me to... He's um... not even just violating your constitutional rights. He's violating all, all the, the, the Supreme Court ruling. But they, uh, he's told me they're going to keep me in there till Monday, at least, even if I do bail. But well, I'm not well, giving them something I don't have to. They're violating. Right now, I'm trying to get your information. Well, 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 in I haven't committed a crime. You, 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 are, you, you admit I haven't committed a crime. You're talking and you are listening. You really are. It's, you know, I'm losing my patience. But the point I'm trying to tell you is I stopped you, but I'm placing the vehicle. Exactly. Well, no, I've committed a crime. Let me finish. At that point. I have a legal stop because you cannot be traveling on my highway or his city. Your street. highway. This isn't your highway. Yeah. This is public road. Okay. Are you going to step out of the car or not? This is, where, where, where is okay. it? Where you is can it? go ahead and step over here now. Now, uh, now I'm losing my what, what, are, what are you arresting me for? No, we're going to pass cooperation now. If he doesn't want to come out, I'll break the window and I'll force him out. He didn't want to come out when he talked to you. I let you guys talk. Now you guys just want to keep telling me about stuff that doesn't matter to me. And I know it won't get through. No, it's all recorded. You're, drunk, you're too drunk right. on your power, power right now. Good luck to you, Deputy Orr. Red hair, tattoos, and the only good looking deputy is with red hair. So, well, go ahead and step over I, here now. I need to look after my well being. No, I'm probably going to tell the car, too. Well, the thing because is, now you're we're being be uncooperative. Taking, you're taking my, my property? Yep, and you're out of the vehicle. I gave you the chance to cooperate. You didn't want to cooperate. You want to step out of the vehicle right now? I'll well, cooperate I, with I, you. I need, what, 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 Are you step out of the car or not? Are you step out of the car or not? If I step out, y'all ain't gonna take me to jail? But right now, I'm losing my patience because you're gonna go to jail. And whether I have to force you out or you step out. I'll get out, you ain't gonna take me to jail. Step out. Regardless, step out. You're coming out regardless. Hey. Man, I don't wanna go to jail till Monday. Come on, man. Well, dude, it's your fault for pushing it this far. I mean, if you would have just handed it over at first, you would not have been in this situation. But no, you had to act like a self entitled softard, so now you're gonna have to pay the price. Mike. If I give you, okay. No, I got. I got. Are you step out of the car or not? It's your last chance. I he said I'll give you the information. You don't get out of the car right now. Mike, okay, he said I'll give seconds. you this information. Two more seconds. He just said I, he's a chief, man. Two more seconds. Get out of the car. Hey, man, get out of the car. And I can hear him. going to give you a ticket. Okay. All right, I'll do that. Well, I mean, it's up to step out of the car, and they're going to pull the car. I just... What we have to do is just file a... Well, he turns off his camera at this point. I suspect he might have gotten arrested, but you know what? I don't think he'll ever tell us or tell us the truth about his situation, because, you know... They wouldn't know the truth if it came up and bit them in the ass. At any rate, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.